hello once again welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to create a cartoon animated video just like this we're going to do this using canva so we're going to go to canva just log on to canva and then go to video section so when you go to video section all you need to do is to click on video so click on create blank so we're going to create a blank new video and we're using this aspect ratio if you want to do this for a mobile device then you may like to go with this mobile mobile video okay we want to go with this aspect ratio so i'm going to go to this and click on create blank now this is going to open in a new tab and we need to add our beautiful city background if you look at the video over here we have this amazing city background and we actually need to add that to our design so the first thing we need to do is to go to element and then we can just go to the search element over here and then search for our element that we want to use in this case we want to search for a beautiful city background so i'm just going to search for beautiful city or beautiful street and then we switch to the graphics column or you can just click on all here at the graphics tab or let's just click over here and then just go through and select whatever city background you want to use for your design containing a street because i want cars and human beings to be moving on that so because of that i want to get some city background i can have one here that i can even use so this is another one that i can use and we have a lot if you scroll down you have a lot so i just want to go with this i'm just going to select this and then make sure i stretch this to cover my entire page okay so this is basically what i want to do so i'm going to select this so you can see i have my first element added to this so we have the duration over here you can increase or decrease the duration over here by default you see five seconds so you can actually increase that now the first thing we need to do you maybe want to add cars moving on the street so you can easily go and search for maybe car cars moving whatever just search for when you, whatever you want to add to your design and then make sure you're using the graphics option over here it's very helpful so you can see we have some animated cars moving if you want to go with that that is cool we're actually going to add human beings working as well but let's first add the car over here and then let's resize this when we resize let's make sure this is on the road so you can place it over here because i'm likely going to add another car moving from the right to the left so this car is going to move towards the right okay so now that i have my car i'll look for my second car there are other cars over here that i can pick from so i'll scroll down a bit and then look for another car okay so let me just go down a bit you can just pick any car and then you animate it so let me just use this one so this is another car here i'm actually going to add it to my design okay so let me just add it and then place it somewhere here okay so now we have two cars over here we actually going to animate this but let's first of all add the rest of our objects so let's say let's get person walking so let's say let's get a person walking we want to add some creates a busy city so i'm just going to add someone walking over here reading a book and then the person is walking okay but this object will not be static as you can see we want them to move but we'll rather fix them and then later animate them so you can add as many as you want i want to add another one from here and then go ahead and resize this and then place it somewhere here lastly i want to get someone riding a bicycle okay i want to get a boy riding a bicycle that will be the last part and we will now start the animation process okay so i think i have a lot of objects over here i prefer to go with this and i'm just going to resize this so I'm actually going to make sure this is on the road as well. Now we want to actually animate this. We don't want them to be at one part. We want them to be moving around. So let's first select this. So we select your object that you want to animate. Okay, so this is just about a little over five seconds. So this is what we want to animate. Select that and then go to animation. And then with Canva, we have this new option called create an animation. So it gives you the op option or the flexibility to create your own animation so when you select this whatever object you want to animate just drag it towards the path so i want it to move towards the right like this so i'll just drag it towards the path like that so you can see if i release this after that you can see my object will start moving okay so this is just a test case for this we can drag this to actually move completely from the screen okay so let me remove the path and this time around we want the car the car to move across the entire street so let's drag this way 
and then i'll drag it until it's completely off like that okay you can drag it completely off and it's actually going to work so now any other object you want to work on we can actually do that the speed is here we can actually increase the speed of this car so we we'll prefer the car moving faster than the human being so you can see over here this car is moving faster let's select this one as well and then we can actually create the path for this one also okay so let's just move it a bit just for demonstration purpose you can actually work on this the way you want i want to increase the speed a bit like this okay so now if i decide to play this you can see the cars are all moving now we want to work on the humans being as well and then the guy riding the bicycle so i'll select the guy and then create the animation now i'm just going to move this and then i prefer this guy to go completely off the screen like that so if i release this you can see now everyone is moving around this is perfect okay so now let's select the object the human beings as well and then try to animate them let me just give them just some simple animation like that and that is it so i'm just going to release this and you can see the movement around it's now becoming a very busy city people moving around do this for the last one i'm just going to drag this across like this and i didn't really get this perfect it works into the car lane which is quite bad that is not what i want so i just want to fix that i'll first select this you can go by remove the path and then recreate the path again so i want it to be on the pavement like this so i prefer to do something like this if you want to drag it completely off screen you can do that and this is better if you want to add audio background you can go to element and then search for city so i can just type city and then go to the audio option over here just scroll and then go to audio and then you can get some very nice audio background for this you can see we have the city traffic 15 is quite okay i can use that for the background so you can actually play that and see how it will sound if you are cool with that then you can add it so you can see this is sounding as a busy city and i can click and add that to this and then i can just go ahead and play this so you can see if i play this you can see how amazing this is looking So this is now a very busy city and then we can even duplicate this to create another scene or maybe even change the background so when you come here just click on these three dots and then go to duplicate so we can actually duplicate this page we can actually duplicate this page to create our next scene so i just want to reduce this if you want this sound i will show you how you can get it back so this is our next scene over here so for this scene we want to use a different background so we can select this entire background and then go and then delete it so now we don't have a background for this so let's go back to element we can still search for the same thing we can just go for uh, beautiful streets so just search for beautiful street again and we can get different background to use and then do some few adjustments to that okay so i prefer to go with this this time around and then just expand this to cover the entire background i'm just going to do this and then make sure this covers the entire background like this okay and that is it we need to actually right click on this go to layer and then send to what back we have sent back backward and send to back so send to back we send it behind everything so send to back and then we can see we have our object still there okay but the position and alignment is not exactly as we want so i'll just select them and then just reposition them back and make them the land on the streets as i want okay so we are just trying to change the environment i don't really need this car again i still prefer this and i want to get a different thing this time around i want to get another object let's say probably a plane or let's say yeah something like that we want to make the place quite very busy so let me say moving okay even if i go to moving car it's going to give me different different objects we are likely going to get something like a plane to use okay so let me just go down a bit okay so you can see i have some helicopter here which i can just select and use so i can just resize this and then send it to the top so basically the helicopter will be above everything so we just want to place it somewhere mm -hmm. here place it somewhere here and then we actually need to animate it because it's supposed to move around so just go to animate here and then we're going to use the same option go to create and meet and then now this is the only one selected and then we can just move 
the path like that i want to move it off screen if you prefer you can just move it off screen like that completely off the screen okay so something like this you can see the plane is also moving and it will move like that okay that is perfect now we want to use the same busy street background over here the audio here you can actually right click and then duplicate it like that and then it will just apply to the next one so when you play this So you can see everything is now perfect you want to add some transition between mm -hmm. that you can just click over here you can just click over here between the two pages and then you can just add a list wipe transition i prefer using a wipe transition between the two like that so you can see i have this amazing transition that is going between the two so if i decide to play this now and then you can see after the first one after the first page the transition will come before the next one so let's now try and play this together and see okay so this is amazing even with this object or this human being we can actually try to take them off screen by doing the animation extended animation further so this is just a concept i'll be doing more animated video using this same concept so remember to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any future video but before we complete this we first need to download this i'm just going to show you the process you need to download this just go to share just click on the share icon mm -hmm. over here click on the share icon here and then go to what download and then this is going to be an mp4 because it's a video format so make sure the mp4 canva will suggest that for you which is the best over here just so just go ahead and click on what's download okay so after downloading the video this is the final video this is the final outcome Let me know your views at the comment section. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumb up and subscribe for more videos like this. Till I come your way again. Bye bye.